Normally for reels and jigs, I recommend some form of anchoring, although I don't like that word because it suggests huge pressure, but contact with the banjo so that you have a pivot point through which to achieve speed and accuracy. For this, we're going for a lightness of tone. And so a lot of the time I pick away from the bridge to come up here where the sweeter tones are. But to really have some support for the hand doing that, I suggest planting very lightly your pinky finger, or maybe even just the edge of your pinky finger on the head of the banjo. And that will give you enough support so that you don't fall into floating wrist syndrome, which is essentially playing from your elbow. And we want to avoid that at all costs.